Hi everyone, today I want to encourage you with words out of Psalm 31. And uh, it says there, verse 1 and 2, In you, Lord, I have taken refuge. Let me never be put to shame. Deliver me in your righteousness. Turn your ear to me. Come quickly to my rescue. Be my rock of refuge, a strong fortress to save me. I find it very interesting that this psalmist says or asks the Lord to turn his ear to, towards him. I think it works out of a position of assuming that God can hear, that God is close by, that God is um, in the vicinity to such an extent that he can literally just turn his ear to us. And uh, I've been in conversations with a lot of people um, in the high points and the low points in their lives, in the moments of uh, gratitude and, and thankfulness and gladness, but then also in, in the moments of despair and, and lostness. What I find amazing is that people in both of these positions uh, start their prayers with the same word. It is as if we know that when it's good, when things are great, when we are elevated, when we are excited about life, that we can say, Lord, thank you. It says something of our faith towards this Father. But then also when I, I engage with someone that's, that's really down and up, that's in a dead end, um, they also start the prayer of, of lostness with the word, Lord, Lord, can you help me? Lord, can you hear me? Lord, turn your ear to me. Um, and for me, that, that says something about a God that is, that is with us, that's present. So may you be encouraged today to find your refuge in God, to know that His ear is close by and that He hears you.